What's up guys, South Florida Angler here with another fishing video and in today's video I'm here with Javi and we're going to be doing some freshwater fishing. We're going to be looking for peacock bass, largemouth bass, um, anything big that we could hook on. We just left Captain Jack's bait and tackle. We got some live shiners and uh, yeah, to stick around. Hopefully we catch something big. Hope you guys enjoy the video. Alright guys, so we are here. We made it to the first spot. Um, Javi found this spot on Google Maps. It's actually uh, by the airport. You can probably see the airport tower somewhere over there. Um, what's that? More that way? Yeah, we'll move right now. So hopefully we'll get something big here. If not, we'll go somewhere else. Oh, that's a big one, guys. Oh my God. Dude, this thing's huge. Yo, give me a hand, give me a hand. Oh my God, yes. This thing is huge, bro. Oh my God, I'm falling. Look at it. Where is it, bro? Bro, watch. It's about to come up. Hold up, give it a second. I don't want to tighten up the drag because it's too big. Look at it right here, look at it, look at it. Right here, bro. Look at it, look at it. I can't bring it in, Javi. The line is, remember, this is six pounds. Hold up, remember not to get it. Get it by the leader, if anything. It's under the log. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Oh my God, dude, this thing is huge. Oh my God, hold up. Don't grab it by the line. Don't grab it by the line. Once you see the leader, grab it by the leader. Let me get it tired. You see it? Oh my God, this thing's massive. Do you see the leader? Get it by the leader. Get it by the leader. Don't grab it by the line. Leader, get it by a leader. Right, a little bit more forward, right there. <laughs> Dude, look at the size of this thing. Oh my God. Oh my God. Look at the size of this thing, dude. Oh my God. Oh my God, this thing's beautiful, dude. Look at the size of this. <gasps> and I caught it on six pounds, dude. That's awesome. Let's unhook them really quick and get them back in the water. All right, guys, one last look. What a beauty. Look at that. All right, he's good. All right, guys, so the reason why I was so excited when catching that fish, it's because, I mean, I don't know if you guys could see, but this is a very tiny rod. It actually only has a six pound um, line on it. So I was scared that you know, he was gonna snap it. That was a pretty big peacock, you know? So that's why I was a little excited. Um, but yeah, let's see if we can get on another fish. I think we're gonna move spots. Um, we haven't gotten any other bite except from that peacock that I caught. Um, oh. This right here looks promising. You know what? Let me grab another bait. We're gonna cast here one more time and if we don't catch anything here then we're gonna move spots i'm pretty sure i'm gonna catch something here um there's a big tree trunk falling in the water there which is perfect cover for a uh, largemouth bass and peacocks so let's go ahead and cast out and maybe we could catch something all right so that was a epic fail yeah i got the scissors absolutely no bite All right, so want to try a different spot? Yeah. All right, cool. Get one of your hands. Uh, so this is the. Oh my god. Yeah. You stained your pants. Dude. I know. I mean, it'll come off. All right, so we made it to a second spot. It's a little lake in between some corporate offices. Um, hopefully we don't get kicked out of here. But we'll see how it goes. All right, guys. So. 
came to a third spot because the second spot was absolutely trash. The second spot was not very good. So we're here. Uh, hopefully we got something. Good workout. <laughs> this guy hooked the house. This guy <laughs> oh my god, dude, how the hell did it reach all the way over there? Oh, you might pop it. What uh what line test do you have on that? Oh just pull it, just pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it, pull it. It's not gonna pop. Unless you're not very bad. There it is. Oh, he lost it. All right, guys. So quick update. Um, we're going to a four spot. First spot was okay. We caught that peacock. Second and third spot were not that great. That third spot looked really good. It looked promising, but there wasn't really any fish like biting. Yeah. We saw him swimming around some peacock. We actually saw School of Mullet um, swing around, but we got no bites. So we left there. We grabbed lunch. We stocked up on uh, on trainers, and we're going to hit up another spot. So stick around. All right, guys. So we are here. Made it to the spot. You guys might find this place very familiar. This is probably where we come most of the time when we come freshwater fishing. Come on, pero Come on, kid. Oh, oh, careful with the branch. Nice pee. Yeah, got you got it? Yeah. All right. Oh, it's a male. Look at the hump. Yeah. See a little hump on the head? Nice, dude. Was that the fish that jumped earlier? Nice pee, man. Get my photo. Oh, buddy. Like over here. Okay. Nice, man. All right, guys. So that is it. It's a wrap. Um, we literally spent the whole day fishing just to catch two peacock bass but you know what it was well worth it it's been a while since we've fished so i guess we're kind of rusty i don't know we have to get in the habit of fishing again um also guys let me know if you guys like the head mount or the chest mount better um last time i made a video with the chest mount i got a comment saying that the angle was kind of weird so that's why i did this video with the head mount let me know in the comments below what you guys think Please make sure to check out my friend, Captain Jax at Captain Jax Bait and Tackle. He has all the live bait, all the artificial lures you guys need. And if he doesn't have it, he'll make sure to have it for you. So give him a call or check him out. I'll leave his info down in the description below. Um, that's again, uh, Captain Jax at Captain Jax Bait and Tackle here in Miami. Huge shout out to him for helping us out. Um, once again, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please remember to keep the waters clean, lines tight, and until next time.